Teachers and child care workers in all states became eligible for vaccines this week. Missouri, among a bunch of several states that's been slower in getting out vaccinations. But one local school administrator says this is a big step for schools nationwide. Here's KQ2's Madeline McClain. School districts and local health officials across northwest Missouri editing their vaccination lesson plans. From Buchanan County. We've also been compiling a list of staff members who would like to be immunized um, through our partnership. Technically, it's with Mosaic and the, the health department. To Andrew County. The plan is for Mosaic. Um, you know, we've, I've talked to, to a couple of the districts uh, so far, and if there's people that can't make it the day that Mosaic's going to do that, then we will try to cover those ourselves. All the way up to Atchison County. We've already touch base with them. We know how many, about how many um, vaccinations are needed for that tier, and we're ready to jump as soon as March 15th gets here and we have vaccine. And for all of these individuals, the fun part is planning for what comes after vaccinations. It's going to be just the icing on the cake, I guess you could say. Last year, classrooms emptied out because staff or students were sick with COVID or have been in contact with someone sick. This has been a crazy year. <laughs> I'll be glad when it's over. I won't lie. This semester, there's already been less quarantines and less people out sick with COVID. So our numbers are really great. Now, have we worked really hard to get there just right now doing our other mitigation strategies? But with vaccinations, quarantine guidelines can be relaxed further. That's why getting the vaccination to me is so valuable is because it will help cut down on absenteeism and it will keep more folks in the buildings. St. Joseph School District nurses already received their vaccine shots and already feel the benefits. For me personally, I just feel a little bit I'm more confident in being around others and feel I don't want to give anybody anything. And I know a lot of people feel that way. They, I don't want to hurt anyone else in, in this uh, uh, pandemic, but I do see that in uh, folks that they do feel a little more comfortable after having their vaccination. Reporting, Madeline McLean, KQ2 News. Missouri's Phase 1B Tier 3 extends vaccine eligibility to teachers and other essential workers, but does not officially open until March 15th. However, officials with the St. Joseph School District say some of their teachers and staff were able to jump in line early through federal vaccine plans.